I would do that. We have found a monster zoo. Run and flee. The queen bee, the king bee, honestly, it didn't seem polite to ask. Yeah, I'm sort of just fleeing from these guys at this point. I don't have enough problems trying to kill all this stuff. The critical hits. The critical hits. Stop carrying me. So my guys to come come and try and kill me. Oh my guys trying to kill me. Well, I'm not dead yet. Hey, I love it up. The balls are inert. Alright, well at this point I suppose I should talk a little bit about my leveling scheme. So, I basically maxed out swords, crossbows, and dual building, and I only have access to like artful dodging, flay ship shaping, and perception to basically level up. Of this stuff, I think I might go out for art artful dodge just to get more like dodge abilities. But, it's also something I noticed, I could get this other stuff over here, like the flesh making perception. Game perception let me like you know be able to like you know get more loot, and eventually I get eye lasers, which, is, which sounds cool. The think we'll focus on survival first for now. So transcendental dodge. Sometimes you can dodge almost out of reality and then back into it. Where this ends up being a good thing is to be seen on a per case basis. You may activate this ability at will. Let's put that there. Kill that guy. Oh, what this guy's gonna do to me. There he goes. The countering, it's real. Hit. 
Just slowly killing away. Well, that took a while just for the initial part. And that's just because, like, you know, there's like a bunch of Arctic that I ran away there. If there wasn't so many Arctigles, I probably would have like stayed to fight a lot more, but if that many Arctigles I didn't want to play, you know, risk it. These guys actually sort of scare me, the, um, the spellcasters. We'll wait a little bit more. Let's try this. Yep. Like I was around, but whatever. So what did that do for me? Regal Vim, you're in view of Regal Vim. Cool, kill that guy. I'm actually starting to run out of bolts after all this. Amazingly enough. Well, time to pick up some stuff. Pow! 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 That looks like fun. God, it's a mess in here. The bodies, they're everywhere. Get 
There's still so much to kill. Let's see here, let's attack you. And we'll use a poison bolt. And a stun bolt. Pow! So apparently no one's trying to kill me. Oh no, my mana! So I can kill my mana, these guys. Just gotta watch out for that. There was that guy. It's funny how all the gnomes are trying to kill me, but not the, uh, the de decisions. He's in a way. Ah, let's use one of these one bolts. Pow! Other stuff in here, these guys actually scare me the most, which is why I'm kind of happy they're not attacking me. Getting rid of them makes it a lot easier for me to kill the rest of these. Guys, I guess. Cool, kill that guy. There we go, kill those guys. I still gotta know him to kill somewhere. Everybody's over here. He saw me. He must die now. I wonder what this does. Interesting. You know, it's funny how many bolts I have left after all that. I really rinsed my bolts there quite a bit. Wasn't that gnome?
Okay, where can I find this guy that I'm missing somewhere? What if it's a visible guy? Like one of those guys that, you know, running around that's invisible? Or maybe he's behind this door over here. Where's the last monster to kill? This is annoying! The music for the monsters is cool and all, but I wish it was over. I suppose this is one bad thing with the monsters do stuff like teleports away. I suppose I'm going a little bit fast for my own good here, but whatever. The embossed serpentine gauntlets. So there's a pair of gauntlets to replace my current ones. There's the mass pe me um, pity mechanism to watch out for. And here's the clockwork power limb. So you can make this with uh, steel, spring loaded power core, and other stuff. Maybe we'll make that. The Reef of Iron Thorns. It feels like pain, but it'll hurt anyone who tries to hurt you at that. Alright, let's see why I mass pit pitted wherever. Alright, so here's these guys to kill. Okay, fine, some plastic. Alright, well, I've more or less run out of uh, stuff to attack with.
Now, what what this does? So I guess this gives me an extra dodge. Is what this does. Oh, so that's what it does. It lets me dodge away when I get hit. Right, that's still full. Well, let's see here. You know, I should probably replace this old ring that I've got over here. The new ring? Isn't that Master Zoom music just awesome? It just keeps going and going. Make some of that stuff. I dodge everywhere and anywhere. Yeah, I'm not sure that's all that useful at the moment, so let's cancel it. Project that. Hmm, stuff is up there. Well, that's all fun. Made all the way back over here. But yeah, that uh, music getting really annoying in the background at this point. I realize that's not going to help too much, but it'll help somewhat. It'd be nice if you could see where like guys in the monster zoo are, so that you know if you have to run after them, you don't you know, have to look too far for them. That guy's dead. There is no walk away, it's just die, die, die. Well, cool, we kill these guys. Make that a little bit stronger. Cool, secret passage fang. And frill potion. 
critical hit. You know, it'd be really annoying if, like, that monster that I have to kill is an invisible monster, and like, you know, I just have been passing it by every, sing every single time. But I honestly don't see the monster I have to kill wherever it is. Down, down part of the map here. Plastic bolts. I can fire those. That guy's popped out of nowhere. But yeah, honestly, there's like, you know... Where is the monster? Where is he? It's probably one of the teleport monsters and like the teleport is somewhere I can't find him. Escape. Well, oh, there we go. Kill everything in here. Sort all that, I guess. A diamond! Finally! Found one of these! Alright, let's see here. Let's sort. And of this stuff in here, I guess I want to keep a lot of it. This guy. Your inventory is full. So here's something to note. I actually could go to um, the next level or the previous level or go to my pocket dimension, but if I do so, I'm actually going to lose out, out on the Monster Zoo reward. But it's gotten to the point where I've like cleared like this entire level. I'm just going to lose a reward if I don't um, do it, so. It sucks, but I'll be done.
so to speak. So I'm not gonna get through war for that monster suit I basically did because, you know, this stupid thing isn't like letting me do anything, but whatever. 